What's going on, people? Welcome to the LV Live show. I am LV Live. Please hit that like, share, subscribe button. Once again, I want to thank all the new subscribers for coming by to my channel, man. It is truly, truly appreciated, right? Happy New Year's to you and yours. Happy New Year's to you and yours, right? So the Knicks pull off a great victory tonight by beating the Phoenix Suns 102-83 to with the return of Jalen Brunson. He had 24 points. Great game for him, Randall. Scored at 29, 16 balls. Randall has been a beast. He's definitely going to be an all-star this year. Uh, great contribution from guys like <clears throat> Big Mitch. Big Mitch had, you know, he was a double-double. Had 10 points, 10 rebounds tonight. IQ, he had uh, 15 tonight. So it was just a great contribution. Uh, Quentin Grimes had 12. Altogether, it was just a great contribution from the Knicks. You know, let's take a look at the highlights here. Uh, it was just great to see, you know. But the return of, well, once again, the return of Jalen Brunson. So it was fabulous, man, right? He was back. Uh, you know, the Knicks pretty much had an amazing first quarter. They went up 23-11. It was the second quarter. Jalen Brunson poured in 16 in that quarter. The Knicks ran away with the game in the, from the first half, and that was pretty much it. The rest of the quarters were pretty much even. But the Knicks took the lead, man, in the first half, and that was pretty much it. There was no more looking back. Uh, the Knicks were great all together, man. Just they seemed like they had their legs back. But I think a big part of it was they had their injury, right? They had Jalen Brunson. Uh, he changes everything for those guys. I mean, he just does. I mean, just watching him and watching what he could do on a night-in and night-out basis. Uh, he started off a little rusty in the first quarter, but, you know, he pretty much got his legs underneath him. Poured in 16, and Randall's just been a beast, man, all together. Uh, IQ's coming back. IQ's looking strong. But Mitch, to me, dominated Aiton, right? Aiton was the big guy that came out the same draft as Mitch, right? So, you know, of course, he got, he's going to get his weight up and get ready to play a guy like him who he feels probably should have been drafted higher than. Um, so, of course, he wants to show out against him. Um, Mitch pretty much dominated, having a double-double. But altogether, man, it was just a total team effort. Uh, it really was. They played great defensively. Fabulous. You know, they didn't really, really foul much. Uh, it was just, you know, just all together, man, just a fabulous game. Um, what I love most is just that you're kind of seeing the team um, really start to, you know, take on the identity of who their point guard is. I mean, you know, he, he plays hard. He plays, you know, he plays with tenacity. He pretty much, you know, takes on the leadership of that team, and they all follow suit because um, a lot of times they don't feel like they have to do it all. But when he's there and with the ball in his hands, you know, he just makes guys feel more confident in how they play. Even look, Mitch. Mitch plays better, right? Um, but, guys, you know, one thing I have to say, man, we got to really take our hat off to Randall. Right I mean, we just have to. He plays hard every night. I think he almost played again for almost 40 minutes tonight. Uh, he did play exactly 40 minutes. Um, so we got to take our hat off to him, man. He's been carrying a team with injuries, guys being down, and he's been out. He's been playing. I think he's played every game this year. Um, he's definitely an all-star. I don't see why he wouldn't be. Um, he's he, he's turned it around so far this year, right? We got to see how he ends off the season, right? But so far, man, I think he's, you know, won the fans back. Just, you know, that's one thing about New Yorkers. That's what we love, right? We just want you to play hard. That's it. And that's I think that's what Randall has been doing. And guys, you know, the team, you know, excuse me, not the team, New Yorkers are going to acknowledge that. And we pay attention to that. He plays, he plays hard. He doesn't complain. He's just out there going hard every game. He's not taking days off. Um, and he's playing well. He's shooting at a high clip. Uh, it's, you know, he's just, he's, he's just playing well. Man. You have to really, really take your hat off to him, especially what happened last year and how things didn't really go out and go in his favor. Uh, he came back with a new attitude this year. And it's played, played, played tremendous, man. He has to. But it's glad and glad to see that uh, Brunson is back, which is big. So, you know, all together the team looked great, which was a great win, especially coming back off of, uh, you know, coming back off of New Year's, coming back from that road trip. It's great to kind of start off the new year uh, with a win, right? So, awesome win. All right, but listen, but that's my show. I'm LV Live. Please hit that like, share, subscribe button. Hit that like button. Hit that like button, people, all right? Also, too, please leave comments, all right, so we can go back and forth and debate. And once again, please subscribe. All right, I'm LV Live, and that's my show, and I'm out. Peace.